Okay, hey guys, we are gonna talk a little bit about class business in this video. Um, so just a few things that maybe the disclosure doesn't talk about. Um, the first thing, pencil sharpeners in this classroom, we have two. The first one is over here. It's this electric pencil sharpener. It's very loud and annoying, so don't use that one while I'm talking, but it does sharpen your pencil really well. And on the opposite side of the room, we have a little crank hand sharpener. Also works very well. Um, and both of those, when we do colored pencils, we won't use, we'll get out some hand sharpeners. But that's where you can find pencil sharpeners in the classroom. Um, for hall passes, we're getting new hall passes this year. I don't know what they're gonna look like. But when you need a hall pass, I need you to talk to me first. Um, I let one person go to the bathroom and one person get a drink at a time. A drink you don't need a hall pass for, it's right outside the door. But I need to know that you're getting a drink or I need to know that you're leaving the room. So if you need to use the hall pass, Tell me, um, don't just go. <laughs> uh, if something were to happen and we went into lockdown or something, I would have no idea you were gone. So I need to know when you leave the room, okay? Um, okay, some privileges. We have some great privileges. I have this awesome couch in my room. This is the all-star couch. Now the all-star couch um, is where my all-stars sit. So people who've gone out of their way to help clean up, um, help people out, things like that can get you an opportunity to sit on the all-star couch. I've got this little bin right here. Um, and inside is little nomination things. So if somebody helps you clean up um, or they're just always going out of their way to make you feel included, things like that, you can come nominate someone to sit on the all-star couch. You take the form out of the top drawer, put it in the second drawer. Um, and then each day I will come update the list of who gets to sit on the all-star couch. Um, so that you can, you know, enjoy class from the comfort of a couch, which is great. Um, so that's our all-star couch. Another privilege that we have um, is we get to talk while we work. Um, when we first start a project and we're in the planning phase, we have it be silent because I want those I like ideas from your brain only. Um, so we will have some quiet working time, but then on work days when we're working, you can talk quietly to the people around you. If it gets out of control, we cut it back. Um, and hopefully we never lose that privilege. But if we do get warnings, we have three warnings or two warnings. On the third time that we're way too loud as an overall class, we just go to no talking. Um, it's not very fun when we do that. So if we just keep our voices low, then everything will be good. Um, okay, phones. Uh, phones in this classroom. Sometimes we'll use them. Um, sometimes we, we have access to computers, but sometimes we will use phones for things. If you don't have a phone, that's okay. I always have the technology for you should you need it. Um, and a lot of people want to listen to music. Again, this is a privilege. So while we are focused and on task and working, some, I, I will let you listen to your own music. The rule with music, when we first start working, I'll give you like a minute and I understand that for that minute, I will see your phones out. You'll be finding your playlist. You'll be putting your headphones in. But then your phone has to go away. In your butt pocket, your side pocket, your backpack, somewhere where I will not see that phone at all. Because you are going to have a well-set up playlist that you press play on so that you don't have to pull that out and skip songs because that's when I'll take your phone. Okay, you're not changing the music. You're not skipping songs. You press play. You put the phone away. Okay? Um... There's no reason to have them out, and if that becomes a problem, we won't listen to our own music. I listen to great music, but some people decide they want music with words or popular pop culture music, um, and we listen to a little bit more calming, relaxing music. So don't abuse that privilege so that we can continue to use it. Um, phones should always be away um, unless directed. Don't come in the room with your headphones in. Um, you're going to say hi to me when you come in, and I want to know that you're hearing what I'm saying to you, so no headphones on your way in. Um, when it's work time, that's when those things can get pulled out, okay? Um, and just let me know if you have any additional questions. Thanks.